and welcome back to Bike Gear, episode five. So, episode three, thank you very much. And today we have got a young little lad here called Jim Lee. He's back on the scene after his departure for an episode. <laughs> Louis, what are you going to say about him back? Well, what happened is with, uh, we took on Ben, and he did. He wasn't a good credit to the show. And so we took Jamie Lee to court after hitting the producer and it came back that the person who got hit by Jamie Lee testified and said that it wasn't Jamie Lee. He didn't like Jamie Lee. So today, and here he is there, Jamie Lee. Well, also, yeah. we're going to be testing out one bike today. Uh, just probably the best bike I'll for it. Just for that. It added something else over the last couple of days as well called a speedometer. Mm, worth about 20 quid at the moment. So uh, it shows you like the time, how long it takes you to get to a place, miles per hour, which is the record is 21.47. We're going to be trying to beat that today. And that is just in this little street here. Yeah, so we going to fly down there, 21.47, which is it's not bad for a bike. Not bad. But we should get faster. We should get about 30. So yeah, let's go. Yeah, this year, our year. record should be around about 30. Fuck the police coming straight from the underground. A young nigga got it bad because I'm brown. And not the other color, so police think. Retail price was about five fifteen, so we'll go through what what needs to go through basically. Gears are a lateral, so something like chamarro. So we'll go on to the suspension. It is adjustable, and if you want to do some hard tailing, which is a form of mountain biking, you could uh, adjust this so there's no suspension whatsoever. This is adjustable. And anyway, so um, Jimmy, if you look at this, this is the speedometer. Have a look over here. You've got the oh, you've got the max speed. Pass that through. Yeah, max, max speed, which is that temperature clock tells you what time it is. And uh, Novland just kicked off. Um, total time, distance travelled on this bike so far with the speed on it is ten miles point six two. Like Trip time and average speed is nine point three two now. Right, so, so let's get good. back into more of the bike itself. Really, the seat. Excuse me, Harry. I'll do it later. Right, the seat. Really comfy, I mean it's like not the worst, not the best either. All the framework is detailed, but the only thing that gets me, I get this question though, what? Is this a girl's bike? No it's not, I've typed it in, a man's voodoo is, and it's exactly like this. Uh, the cylinder brake discs are alright and the gears are so smooth. It needs oiling, but the only thing that troubles me is, is that this, like if I spin it now, like, it's like really bad. Spin it. Oh yeah, there we go. It doesn't last that long. Yeah, it's, it's quite out already. So yeah, we're going to get Harry to try it. Harry, come to the garage, Yeah, he didn't match it. This is the total record and he got 21. No, I got 21, just 21. Just 21 there, there so I didn't get How do you anything. Oh, so, yeah, push. so I'm going to do my review Stay now. Like so, yeah, my review is this, this, this. I'm not going to do anything much. I'm just going to go like this. So, for when riding, it is really smooth. So, I'll give the comfort old 10 about a 7, a healthy 7, because he's not the comfiest, but not the uncomfiest. The speed, if it can get to 21 miles per hour around this little corner, the speed's got to be 9 out of 10. The overall standard for its price range, for its comfort, for its speed and its ability, I would go it at 8.4 out of 10. Thank you for watching.